Hi, everyone. I'm Teresa. David. We're retired and road tripping. We're throwing in a surprise video, Bitten Sport, Iowa. We decided it was not originally on our list. We didn't know if we would have time to do it, but we do have time to do it. There's a campground down here. There's historical businesses and whatnot. So we're going to do the best that we can show you. There's a walking bridge over the Des Moines River. Uh, we will show you what we can here. We'll start. We just rolled into town. Here's an old shop. It used to be the blacksmith shop. Okay. General store. We'll get out here in a little bit and walk around a little bit. Here's an old Maple House Inn. And there is a uh, guest room right back there in that train caboose that you can stay in. Caboose Cottage. All right, we're coming on back here to where the visitor, uh, to the campground. Some motorcycles for sale. Okay, here we go. One table for campsite. Checkouts at three. Modern is seventeen, and primitive is twelve. Not parking grass. There's actually quite a few people down here. I'm really surprised. Thirteen by the river. Fourteen. These babies are close. Wow. 16. 17. 19 is open. Okay, we've been down here before. Uh, we've always said that we would take this end spot right down here. 22, 23, that last spot right here. 23, yep. 23. Looks like you can reserve. That might be why no one's there, is because somebody has that reserve this weekend. Uh, this place is packed during the fall seasons festival. This, these are all just way too close for me. Woo. Eight, seven and eight. Four, three, two, one. Four. Okay, we got nine over here. They do have an RV dump down here for it. Right there. All right, we're gonna go over and check out the walking bridge. Here's the restrooms and little covered shelter. Okay, we're gonna park up here. We're walking to the bridge. The Mason House Inn is the oldest steamboat hotel on the river built in 1846 by Mormon craftsmen going to Utah. Okay, here's some history on Mitten Sport. They used to have a paper mill. Among other businesses, a blacksmith, the Grief General Store. All right, we're going to go check out this walking bridge. Eighteen eighty-two, the Board of Supervisors, Van Buren County, awarded a contract to Frank Snyder and Company of Dayton, Ohio, for. Snow wart abutments and piers at the cost of $750 per cubic yard. The bridge was operated and maintained by the Van Buren County Road Department until 1985 as a vehicular bridge. Ownership of the bridge was transferred to the County Conservation Department in 1986. All right, let's go check this out. Bensport, Bonaparte, Kiyosakwa, Van Buren County in general, they have some sort of a festival 
or celebration going on once a month throughout the whole area. So all these cute, quaint little river towns once a month is usually hustling with activity. Well, we keep doing these weird things. I don't, I don't see the light, but there's the toilets back there. And then they have a shower for that little Benton Sport campground. Very nice. All right, we're gonna put a wrap on this video of Benton Sport Campground, Benton Sport community right here. They got the campground with, I forget how many, 28, 28 sites. You got the shower house 23 here, sites. 23 sites. Okay, anything you want to add here, Dave? Uh, nothing I can do. Greg, go. Yep. Uh, this little town is quiet now, but on festival weekends, this little place gets packed. All right, if there's nothing else, America's beautiful. Get out and see it. Like, we'll see you on the road.